streaming podcasts. Today we're playing with four randoms. Playing with randoms isn't always a bad thing, you know? Sometimes you get your occasional killer mixed in. Oh. We got one op landing with us. Let's see if we can get to the gun before him. And we shall. He tried to come through the back door. He saw us there already. He's running. He's running for the other guns. Where's the squad at, man? Orange. We got one out here with us, boy. Oh, he's with a... Oh, he just popped orange. Oh, there's one on the fucking roof up here. We gotta get out of here. There's too many of them. Sometimes you just gotta run. Oh, God, there's a whole gang of them. Oh, he's got a C and Q, boys. Sometimes you gotta run to live. And that's what we're doing here on... Oh, he's shooting at us with the pistol! Ah. Oh, the whole squad out there. And now look at this. Now we're running fives with the solo. Which is... Damn near impossible to do. But see, that's a smart squad they got there. One guy landed on the roof and gave out coordinates and positioning to whoever else was coming. Very smart squad there. Wouldn't wouldn't be surprised if we saw them later on in the match toward the end. Not that we'll be able to tell who they are or anything like that, you know. But, you know. Just whoever that squad was knew what they were doing. To say the least. I guess it's a good thing we didn't chase old boy out the house. Because if we would have, we'd have been gunned down in the streets like a dog. That's my girlfriend laughing at me in the background. It's all good. Let's see what we got going here. You ain't always got to get too many motherfucking combat shotguns now, but I don't think you can ever have. We got no automatic guns right now, which is a terrible thing. And speak of the devil, an automatic gun. Most people seem to prefer the AR over the scout rifle. Scout Rifle does a little more damage than the AR and has a better scope on it. So, in my opinion, I would take the Scout Rifle over the AR. I would take neither if you have. And we got a whole squad right here. That's probably the squad that was chasing us. So, we're going to go ahead and let them have that box. It's five of them. You got no wins there, five on one. You got no wins, four on one out in the open area. I don't care how good you are. You just can't beat an onslaught of bullets coming directly at you. You can jump, skip, duck, throw flashbangs all you want. It's not going to work. Hey. My food's done. 
that's the main problem with H1Z1. You know, you just gotta stop sometimes. Man, who wants to stop? I'm gonna see if I can hide my character right here. We'll be back, see if he dies. Alright, he's still alive! Just in time for the blue drops too, fellas. Now, I usually can't stand it when guys do this, man. They pull up at the end of an engaged fight. Who? Look at this buster down. Clearly. We got some lag. Oh, fuck. Oh. Obviously, my shot's off this morning. First game of the day. Missed four times. It's horrible shooting. I like to say never take a shot unless you're sure of it. But... When you're running solos by yourself on fives, it's pretty fucking hard. I think they all backed out though, that's what happened. Let's see if we can get, ah, uh, fuck. We just cannot get to an unoccupied drop, fellas, this morning. And they're shooting at us, what a bunch of jerks. Damn, boy. Squads is there just hitting these boxes, man. We're just standing no chance at boxes by yourself. Plus, you're out of position, so. Well, we're really not hitting the box now after that. You can just cancel Christmas on all that shit. Airstrike coming in. We got an airstrike here. We got EMPs. Here they come. Get a move on it, Johnny. Get a move on it, Johnny. Woo! We're out of there, boy. We got us, uh. We got us one. We got us one with a full set of body armor. Let's get us a whip now and let's just. Hide out. We don't really need nothing else. We got a cage, Maruder, combat shotgun with the airstrike. I think a lot of guys make the mistake of continuing to go for drops once you already got all the guns you need. There's really no point in continuing to attack drops. You're not going to get any better guns. I mean, once you hit a blue drop to yourself, it's that's it. There's really nothing stronger than the KH or the Maruder. And then if you already have a combat, even if you don't have a combat shotgun, a riot shotgun is, they're the two best close range guns possible. Even the KH is a great close range gun without the scope, if you know how to use it. Now, I usually don't hide and play the gas game. But being that I don't have any teammates, this is the only time that I advise it in fives. Now, if you're playing duos or solo, 
and you're hiding, I mean, you're just a chicken. So, I really don't have too much to say about that. You are what you are. You know? You're a chicken. Ain't that right, baby? Huh? Huh? Yes. You heard her. Chickens. I don't know why I'm leaving my whip. There's body armor here, so I kind of want to, like, post up and fight here. I like to always stand my ground where there's body armor at. Just in case, you know. They got a better shot than me. Better movement. Oh, man. I wouldn't go for the gold drop. Dola. Oh, shit. Good thing about the Hummer is can't no one shoot you through the back, so you know, just put the back of the put the back of the Hummer towards anyone. It's a really good vehicle if you're running five solo. Can't no one shoot you like they did. As you just saw, I just wasted a perfectly good airstrike. What I mean, hey. Just trying to take them out. It's always good to EMP the vehicle first, then throw the airstrike. But damn, man. Well, he killed me. I killed him. So, that sucked. Squad backed out on us. So, we'll be back. Stream again. In a minute. So that's why I fucking...